Okay, joined by Desi Farrell. Desi, uh, you can catch your breath after that uh, titanic game of football here this afternoon in Port Coquive. You come out victors uh, by two points. What did you make of that today? Yeah, it was. Um, look, at it. it was that was going to be a really tough game. Kil- Kildare, Newbridge, Cork looked really, really impressive, and um, obviously we had, a, we had an epic tussle against Kildare ourselves, and um, C- Cork were highly impressive that day had learned a lot obviously from the first outing against Mead um, were much more compact in defence so we were expecting that today it proved to be the case they were difficult to break down at times and trying to hitch on the counter attack so it was it was end end stuff at times a little bit frantic um, you know we'd probably would have preferred if it wasn't as chaotic at times 14 men uh, Parky Cueve the crowd the atmosphere so it's uh, look at it's great to come through a tough tough battle like that and uh, and come away with the two points at the end of the day. A word on uh, the David O'Hanlon save right at the very end, which uh, was an incredible save, obviously, that that meant you, you won the game as opposed to losing it. Yeah, and look what it was, fine margins, and, um, uh, you know, they've stepped up there and made a big play for us, for sure. So, uh, yeah, happy with that. Yeah, um, I guess started the second half quite well, third quarter, I think you made four or five points ahead, but obviously Cork came back into it with that second goal. you happy with how the lads, again, with the atmosphere as it was here today, you're happy with how the lads, I guess, saw the game out in the end, even though it was by two points, the, the, certainly the, the tide was kind of going in the opposite direction for a large yes. part. Obviously, you're disappointed any time when you're conceding goals, and, uh, and that's something for us to look at, um, because it just it, it kept Cork in it. Uh, particularly at times that you feel that we should be kicking on you know we've got a foothold in the game but uh, it didn't materialise that way for us so that's definitely something for us to, to take a look at A word on two players who uh, made an appearance today for the first time uh, this year obviously James McCarthy uh, making his first appearance of the year and Jack McCaffrey as well of course Yeah great to have the two lads back um, for sure and get some minutes into them um, and you know that, that's the balancing act that needs to be done at this time of the year it's given youth its chance and given them some experience and also some of the older hands that uh, to make sure that they're getting game and game time in minutes because it's coming thick and fast at, us, at this stage yeah, and Finally just uh, three games down in the league, uh, how do you assess the campaign overall so far? Yeah, OK, obviously we're unbeaten and um, I think for us it's about trying to improve the quality of performance every time we go out, you know, it's about taking the learnings and, um, you know, trying to implement uh, whatever we've identified as a work-on for us uh, from the previous game and uh, sometimes you have to revisit stuff you've covered and that's all part of it, of course, but uh, um, yeah, there's plenty of, uh, there's eating and drinking in that one for us for sure.